Hi everyone this is Karima and you're welcome to my channel so today i'm going to show you how to reuse the plastic yes i have just converted this plastic can into this beautiful showpiece come flower pot come organizer come pen stand so let's get started first i'm going to show you how to make the gesso for this i'm taking 3 teaspoons of wall putty and i suggest you not to take plaster of paris if you are going to storing it i am adding 2 teaspoons of paint in this here i am taking the primer and adding 1 teaspoon of glue and adding 1 teaspoon of water also just mix this well you can also add more water if required and after mixing you have to create this type of consistency now taking sponge here i'm taking the scan you can also take sanitizer you can also take sanitizer bottle just you have to cut this from center you have applied the first coat now it's dry and take adding the second coat layer but here i'm just creating little little effect like wooden using my paint brush so it's dry second coat Let's try now. I'm taking this clay. This is actually wall putty clay. Just I have added water inside wall putty. Nothing additional. I have added not added additional anything inside this. Just I have created little tight dough and created this clay. You can use this clay whenever you want, but you don't. You have not stored this clay. You cannot store. It's dry. within two hours so just remember that so create this clay only when you have to work on any project so here i'm going to create the tree with the door i'm creating here pine tree with apples and some branches over coming here and there like so creating uh, extra extra shapes so also the design combination also depends upon you how you want to create you can create flowers anything which you want additional inside this so creating leaves like so if you don't have this type of can actually this is the can in which yogurt comes you can cut fevicol bottles any waste bottle you can use any sanitizer in this time sanitizer also common you can also cut it from center use that also anything of your choice So here I'm just adding the apples here and there. Just I have just rolled down the clay, bend it, and added the bottom portion of the paint brush, creating some more designs like so. Adding this uh, here, I'm adding the this very thick layer of uh, strip of the clay. and also creating here this door tapping this here you will see i have created the door also all the shaping portion you have to do very fastly so here i am creating the flower just i have uh, bent the circle and created the flower using this bottom portion of the paint brush also giving this little 3d effect and the apples now just cutting not i have just cut it only i have just give this little shape and dimension in this strip top strip and also adding the circles now just allow to dry so it's dry now you will see now i'm taking this primer and just adding this you can you can skip this step also but for more cleanliness i am adding this now just allow to dry So it's dry. Now it's time to fill the colors in this. For the tree, I'm taking this Persian blue color, and uh, for the leaves, taking the green color. Post these are the poster colors I'm using, and for the apples, here I'm using this orange color. I want to create the pine tree. That's why I've created the branch of the tree in Persian blue color. Now for the door, I'm taking Bernie Sanka color. and for the upper strip of door i'm taking persian blue and inside of the door i have used yellow archi color on the top of the thicker strip i am adding this orange color and just mix with this and give this little shading effect using dry brush technique i have mixed the yellow archi color with this and also added in the background portion yellow archi color 
just using the dry brush technique also giving this little effect shading effect and also added some little little silver pearl colors here and there so the beautiful and a very nice attractive pen stand come showpiece come flower bucket flower pot pen stand what you call this is ready so isn't it a great idea to reuse the plastic in this see here you will see i have added the flowers inside this and it's looking very vibrant you can also keep it as it is on your table it's also looking too nice i have added the pens so my project is done hope you enjoyed this please subscribe my channel for more innovative ideas i will be back again with another craft inspiration thanks for watching see you next time bye bye